Welcome back to Term 4 to all students, families and staff. I hope that you had an enjoyable break and that you got a bit of sunshine that was around in the first week of the holidays. On Tuesday, we were sport with beautiful weather and many smiling faces of students returning from the holidays, with many stories being shared amongst friends as they greeted each other. It was nice to see students returning in their summer uniforms ready for the term ahead. And what an important term it is for many students for a diversity of reasons. Obviously, we know the importance of the first four weeks for our year 12s, and we wish them all the very best during their exam revision and exam period time. I know this is a stressful time for many year 12 students due to the important role exams have on those seeking ATAR scores for certain university courses. So parents, please ensure that students are eating well and getting their required amount of sleep. It's important around the balance that they receive. We have many students who will also commence transition programs from kinder into year prep and from six into seven. I know these programs support many students moving into the college. Most students have around eight weeks of course studies before staff commence writing student end of year reports. So students need to put their best foot forward to ensure they receive outcomes to the best of their abilities. I know that our teachers are committed and will be supporting all students to achieve their very, very best. Again, this term is loaded with many sporting teams, excursions and camps for many students. We're also busy preparing for the college showcase evening and look forward to seeing lots of families coming and looking through the college to see the amazing work being done by our students and your children. Over the holiday period, the junior school received an upgrade with synthetic turf being laid in all place spaces outside their main building and the canteen. Thanks to our amazing maintenance team led by Tony for all they do around the college to keep our school looking beautiful. As a college, we have began interviews for new leadership positions for 2023 and have been excited with the quality of applicants so far. We have also completing our internal positions of positions of responsibility, PORs, uh, for, college, for the college for 2023. I would also like to acknowledge the incredible staff culture in which many of the aspirational staff well in their endeavours in their application interviews for POR positions. Staff that are continually seeking to grow and improve as professionals and as leaders set a standard of high achievement for all around them. Thank you to all parents for your support in having your child in the correct summer uniform for the start of the term. I have asked teachers to be vigilant in following up with students that are not in the correct uniform. We have been informed by PSW that all four uniform stocks are, are in the shop. We are also reminding students that no phones are to be carried on them during school times unless an exemption has been granted. All students are to be, uh, keep their phones in their lockers during the day. This includes using phones in the canteen to pay for food. I know that the canteen manager has already sent out correspondence to students and families around this. I wish all students, families and staff a happy and successful final term of the year. Thank you.